Hi, I'm Rich Green with Director of Instruction here at Tour Golf in Agura Hills, California. Today I want to talk to you about letting your head move so you can make a bigger turn. That's right, I don't want you to keep your head still. Many of my students that come to Tour Golf, they talk to me about I have to try and keep my head still. In actuality, I'm a firm believer that your head actually has to move four to six inches to the right in order to make a full shoulder turn, especially if you don't have much flexibility. Even the guys on tour, they allow their heads to swivel a bit to the right in order to make a full shoulder turn. An example here of someone keeping their head still is swing on the left. My head's gonna stay steady inside the circle. I'm gonna look, I look all bounded up and I have a little bit of a reverse pivot. You can see I've lost my spine angles oh so slightly. On the swing on the right, I'm gonna allow my head to move to the right four to six inches. Now I make a full shoulder turn and I really get behind the golf ball maintaining the angle in my back, my spine angle. The swing on the, on the left, my head has to stay still, otherwise I'm going to move out in front of the golf ball and have trouble squaring the club up at impact. Whereas a swing on the right, all I have to do is rotate around my spine angle and turn and drive back through the golf ball into a nice full finish. Here you have PGA Tour player Brant Snedeker. He's gonna, you're going to see that he's going to allow his head to swivel to the right and move about four inches to the right on the backswing and as you can see you can see the the brim of his hat is pointed slightly behind his right foot this allows him to make a full shoulder turn he also gets a great spine angle from that from there all he has to do is unwind his lower body and torso to square the club up through impact so if you want to make a big full shoulder turn for more power, let your head move to the right. For more information about my golf instruction, you can contact me at richgreenwoodgolf.com.